The latest shocking revelation implies that this dynamic pair paid Dan Evans, a hacker with a criminal record, to distort the facts around a purported cash leak incident between Charles and William. Thus, it was revealed in a recent, shocking disclosure that Harry and Meghan were reportedly complicit in a plot to sway public opinion. The couple allegedly worked with convicted hacker Dan Evans to disseminate fake material about the royal family. These charges lacked a strong basis, but they appeared to be a last-ditch effort to change history. What raised eyebrows was the byline of a certain article, none other than Dan Evans himself, who co-authored the piece. This raised some serious questions about its authenticity. Notably, Evans is also a part of Harry's legal team, making these connections difficult to ignore. The article in question, published by a prominent newspaper, claimed that Charles had pressured Harry and Meghan into making commercial deals in the U.S. after cutting their £700,000 funding for their trial year in Canada. This financial turmoil was allegedly linked to a cash for leak scandal instigated by Dan himself. The scandalous revelations implied that Charles had halted the funding due to the refusal to remove Kensington Palace from legal documents. However, the claims made in the article were swiftly debunked, revealing a web of lies spun by Harry and Meghan. First and foremost, Dan Evans himself confirmed on Twitter that Prince Harry and Meghan had been the ones leaking misinformation, not Prince William. He stated that the Sussex's communication team had briefed the media, including him during their time in the royal family, exposing their strategy of misinformation. Secondly, Dan Evans, the writer behind the questionable article, is a convicted phone hacker. He was allegedly paid by Harry and Meghan to craft a distorted narrative. The article was riddled with inconsistencies and fabrications aimed at portraying Harry and Meghan as perpetual victims, a narrative they shamelessly clung to throughout their public life. They decried being cut off financially from the British royal family, conveniently forgetting their initial declaration of wanting financial independence. Their actions have not only tarnished the image of their entire family but also created embarrassing scandals. It's clear that Harry and Meghan are playing a dangerous game, one that involves distorting facts and manipulating the truth. Their behavior, coupled with their constant quest for victimhood, has disrupted the royal family's legacy. Add some related news for that King Charles III reportedly tried to prevent his exiled son Prince Harry and Meghan Markle from overshadowing the royal family. Charles was not in favor of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's decision to step down as senior royals in 2020, as reported by New York Post. According to a source, the new monarch knew nobody in the royal family, including him, Prince William, or Kate Middleton, was able to bring media attention as much as the Sussexes. Soon after they cut ties from the royal family, Harry and Meghan started garnering attention, however, it was proving lethal for the image of the monarchy. Hence, Charles removed the security of Harry and Meghan to bring them to their heels, so he could maintain the control over the narrative surrounding the royal family. The Sussexes had either to be safely in the tent in Britain or cast away and castigated as comprehensively as possible in order to reduce the threat of them eclipsing the rest of the family, the source said. The greater truth is that Harry and Meghan make better headlines than the King and Camilla or William and Kate, the insider added. The idea of them still being in public service but abroad, and out of the control of the institution, and dominating the media narrative just couldn't happen. It added that Charles tried everything to make it fail, starting with the removal of security and then signing off on a 12-month assault by the UK press on Harry and Meghan and everyone in their orbit, 